This is the big day, the biggest day in world football. The World Cup final, it only comes round once every four years, and the prize is to be the top country in the world game. It's a brilliant setting for Luzhniki Stadium in Moscow, and we're lucky to be here, we being myself, Martin Tyler, and Alan Smith. Yeah, we certainly are lucky. You think back to previous finals, they've not all been absolute entertainment, but I think this one will, given the two sets of strikers on show. I've got to say, I think there'll be goals out there. And we pause now for the national anthems. It's on the subject of France and this uh, wonderful group of young players that they've got. Yeah, well, we talk about Claire Fontaine, we have done so often down the years and still it produces players like Mbappe and Dembele, wonderful young prospects. Well, they do like to play on the counter-attack, this team. Looking at the lineup, Alan, do you think that's the way they're going to address the problems today? That is the way it looks at the moment. We'll find out soon enough, but they are perfectly set up for the counter. They've got lots of pace on the break. I think we'll see that today. Thank you. Enjoy the This is how the visitors will line up today. Puyol plays with Rafael Varane in central defence. It's good to see them going with two strikers today. The world is watching. The 21st World Cup final is underway in Moscow. Well, this is a mouth-watering prospect, and I'm sure the players down there feel the same. Lamar. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Ivan Rakitic. Play back. Good forward play from them. And shoots! It was a real opportunity, but there might be a key moment in there from a defensive point of view. Yeah, well, they really did converge on him quickly. He didn't miss by much, but he's missed it. Modric. Ronaldo. Return to De Bruyne. Mbappe. They can be quick on the break now. Olivier Giroud. It's a good cross got it away from the danger. Pelé almost radiates positivity, this lad. He just looks happy in his work, and uh, when you like that, you tend to produce your best results. Giroud. He's going to try his luck. Goal! It's the first goal in the 2018 World Cup final. Well, what a moment for the lad, and what a good finish it was. He can't have scored many better than this with the bend he's imparted onto the ball. Well, give him credit. You could see exactly what he set out to do there and executed it perfectly. That's good for France. They've got this lead. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Fallet shot! Well, that's easy. And uh, snapped up by Hugo Lloris. It goes out wide again. Watch him go now, Griezmann. Kevin De Bruyne. Well, it is amazing that these two teams have got to the World Cup final. 
It does show the breadth of talent around the globe. Yeah, it is the beauty of football, isn't it? Sometimes you just cannot predict these two sets of players, having said all that, thoroughly deserve to be where they are. The shot gets blocked. Now we have a corner to come via that deflection. Short corner, designed to move the opposition around in the middle. The cross is long. They're level in the World Cup final. Oh, that comes in a timely moment, and I think they deserve that equaliser. Great goal. Well, the uh, attention to detail from the coach on these kind of set pieces, he's faultless. He'll be delighted with that. Different angle on it here. So, away we go at one all. Goal for the visitors. Conte. Samuel Umtiti. Ivan Rakitic. Kevin De Bruyne. Modric. Ivan Rakitic. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Lamar. Could easily have given away a penalty. We say so often we get the benefit of these replays. And the assistant, of course, has one chance to see it. Did he get it right, Alan? Oh, just about. I mean, that is a, a great call from the official over there. There wasn't much in it, a few inches, really. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. This with a chance to go into the lead now. No doubt that's a corner. Short corner. Put in from the wide area. Now they've got to defend this corner. goes the corner it was a promising situation they could have made more of that it's a corner again put in by De Bruyne very close in Alan but not very close to scoring yeah a simple save in the end and it should have been anything but he should have been picking it out of the net the keeper Kevin De Bruyne attacking now Sidibe He's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Pele. Shot on! Well, it looked a bad miss, but I think the defender just put him off. Yeah, he's got to take a lot of credit for that because uh, he had to take the shot quickly, the lad who was trying to score. that out with um, some sharp movement it was good play until they got that challenge in and in he goes with the tackle and the king has a go for goal the king of football Pele Kevin De Bruyne Ronaldo back out off the bar just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception the shot's off play neatly intercepted they can be quick on the break now here's Ronaldo it's De Bruyne and that will be a goal kick here's Conte 
Panama. Come away with the ball cleanly. Great tackle. Trying to Giro. Here's a chance. Goalkeeper exposed. That'll be a corner for France. Pop back. And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Conte. Conte. Slipping it through. Needs to stay cool now. Needs to be quick. All right. Modric. On the attack here. Could get the ball into the box now. They're soaked up. A lot of danger here, but it hasn't hurt them, and now they're on the ball. Well, everything to play for in the second half. We've reached half-time at 1-1. Both teams have had opportunities to get in front. They haven't taken them. It really is a match that's balanced on a knife edge. It... It's the start now of the second half of the World Cup final. Well, will we see a mistake? Will we see a bit of magic now? Ivan Rakitic. They've got the ball back, the interception got it for them. Now Puyol. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Well, the attack had a lot of quality about it until that interception. And here's the shot. He blocked that well. Promising build-up until that challenge. Pogba. Griezmann. Well, they're in a good position here. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Mbappe. Crisp defending there. Kevin De Bruyne. Held up by Ronaldo. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. What they've done here, I think, created a very happy dressing room. And Baran penalised here. France are going to make a change now. Really away from the threat here. Can't keep the ball at the moment. There's good progress with this attack. Modric. The attacking team have got a problem here because the opposition are just sitting in and saying, well, you can break us down if you can. They think perhaps they can't break them down. Hello. Here's Dinia. Little private game between the two of them. Real chance. The keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. Being closed down. Griezmann. Turn pass. Rafael Varane. move and able to cut out the pass that's a good tackle here is Ori it's good work between these two Pele combination of skill and will to hold off the opposition. Dembele. 
Cristiano Ronaldo. Here is Henri. Ronaldo. Ronaldo puts it into the middle. Good chance. Poor effort. Easy save. Yeah, you can see the manager. He's livid with his man for spurning what was a great chance. Rafael Varad. Modric. He's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Pele. He's got his shot off now. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. De Bruyne. Mbappe. Well, he makes that transition happen quickly. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now, here's a chance to get at the opposition. Thierry Henry. Shot up! Hit it hard but not very true. Substitution, and it's going to be France who are going to make it. Mbappe. Olivier Giroud. He's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception, made it look easy, actually. Well, we're playing mind games here as well as the actual game of football. Are they prepared to risk losing to try and win? We're going to find out. Free kick here for France. Mbappe. Now with Giroud. Needs to be quick. Giroud! It's the go-ahead goal in the World Cup final in Moscow. What a moment this might be. Is that going to be... the goal that clinches it in many ways this is the great appeal of the game a team that's given little chance can win as surely they've done with this late goal yeah and i think every single individual has played at the maximum as opposed to the... of all the decisions that are difficult to get right on a regular basis offside probably right up there isn't it alan right here yeah when the defense is pushing up and the players rushing through it's such a difficult decision but it's a good one in this case and here they are, on the attack. It's been a thrilling contest, this. And we're into the last knockings of it. And the supporters, well, they're not showing any sign of losing their stamina. They've been great. Yeah, always love coming to this ground. One of the best atmospheres around. They've not disappointed. And here he is, Diego Armando Maradona. On to the attack now. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Added minutes. Mbappe. Still trying to find an escape route here. Rakitic! Oh, they've done it! They've levelled it up in the nick of time, Alan! Well, talk about resilience and persistence. I think they deserve that equaliser. What a strike that was. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. Well, it's the anticipation as well, wasn't it? Just to get in front of his man. Two teams brilliantly matched in this contest. It's level again. 90 minutes hasn't separated them. Will extra time? Extra time. It's coming up right now. Well, there were some tired legs in that 90 minutes towards the end. They've got to find some edgy from somewhere now. Good forward play from them. 
read the intention. He can put them in front. And he bangs it away. Can he do it? Going for goal! And he knocks in the goal. Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances, and it is a knack. And they send it up high in the back of the net, just under the bar. Well, he's, he's smiling to his teammates. So difficult to stop when they uh, do finish up there. France are behind. Conte. Samuel Umtiti. Ronaldo. He looks up for this Pele. Mbappe. Well, then it goes. The keeper can collect this one. Mbappe! He's put it over. Yeah, nothing wrong with the contact, the power, but accuracy just off. <laughs> On the move and able to cut out the pass. Could be dangerous. Hit by Pele, hit it hard, <laughs> but not very true. Olivier Giroud. Now this looks promising. Great, good vision here. The Pele, great move, great goal. It's always great for the coach when the substitute scores, as has happened here. The way they moved the ball about there, Martin, before creating the chance was really good. They picked the right pass every time there. Brilliant entertainment. The scores are level again. Very tight affair here. Ivan Rakitic. I like the look of this attack. Luis Suarez. Mbappe. Free kick here for France. Well, Two more minutes to play, that sort of added time. Two minutes. And here they are on the attack. He's got his shot off now. On the front foot now, they've got a corner, hoping for the goal that will put them in the lead. Gone short with the corner. Looking for Luis Suarez. Tried for his second goal of the game. Thwarted by the keeper this time. Yeah, and that's a good stop. He stayed on his toes. Good reactions. First period of extra time. It could go all the way here. We're already into the second period, Alan, of extra time. Well, I can feel the tension and I'm sat in the gantry. Pele. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Griezmann. First touch was poor. Little private game between the two of them. Ivan Rakitic on the attack here. Mbappe. Now Blanc. Quick-witted and quick in this movement too to intercept there. Bit of space for him. 
Now out on the wing. Put away, but not out of harm's way. I don't really need to tell you, but this is Maradona. Into Pele. A poor tackle, but it hasn't done any harm, and they've still got the ball despite the challenge on them. Dembele. That's good movement forward here. Good challenge here. Luis Suarez. Ivan Rakitic. Advantage for France, as the referee says, on you go. He could really give it away. Just one minute of added time to come. One minute of added time. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Well, here comes the first penalty taker. At least he can get his kick out of the way. It is a goal despite that run-up, which looked a bit iffy. Penalty now, Luka Modric. That's a fine penalty from him in these circumstances. Well, it's close, but it goes down as a miss. Yeah, it certainly does, and it was a poor effort in many ways. Didn't strike it cleanly. Beat the goalkeeper well in this penalty shootout. And the keeper couldn't keep it out. Oh, you've got to feel for him, Martin. He guesses right, but just can't keep hold of it. Well, he's up to the task with his penalty. And the penalty is off target. Well, nobody likes to see a player miss under those circumstances. So the spotlight turns to this player. Score, and they win. It's as simple as that. If only it was. Keeper's done very well here. The match on the line. If he fails to score, they'll lose it. And he scores his penalty. Well, he knows now successful shot and they've won it and he's put it away to get the winning penalty well it can look easy can't it and he's made it look easy there they are the world champions a day to remember in Moscow they've come through the group stage the round of 16 the quarter-final the semi-final and now they've seen off serious opposition here today. What a moment, Martin, for all these players out there. A moment they will never forget for the rest of their lives. This is special. We expected the strikers to score today, but everyone seems to have checked in. It's been a fantastic effort, one that we'll remember for a long, long time. Yeah, I mean, every time the chance dropped up, it seemed that somebody was on hand to take it. Brilliant. against their names in football history long after they've gone it will say world champion there's no higher accolade no and it's difficult to argue that they're not deserved winners in this competition to a man they gave it their all out there champions of the world the best feeling in the world they're on top of the world. There's a real togetherness amongst those players, and they've needed it at times. They came through some sticky periods in this competition, but it was all worth it, wasn't it? Sharing it with the supporters, and they'll know where their 
families are as well. Forever linked with Moscow, forever linked with Russia, forever linked with the FIFA World Cup. And they've needed those fans at times, they've stuck with them. And quite rightly, they acknowledge that support. They will not want this day to end, but they will get some souvenirs of it now as the photographers gather for these prime pictures of the winners of the FIFA World Cup 2018.